using two steps to solve an equation with whole numbers. In your Alex Pie, mouse over the dark green slice whole numbers to reveal the drop down list of topics you need to cover. Click on using two steps to solve an equation with whole numbers. Here's an example problem. Solve for v. 108 equals 5v plus 13. Simplify your answer as much as possible. Let's click explain. This is a two-step equation. The variable v is multiplied by 5 and then 13 is added. To solve the equation, we work backward. The first step is to undo the subtraction. So we're going to subtract 13 from both sides to try to get this v by itself. So 108 minus 13 is 95, and 13 minus 13, positive 13 and negative 13 cancel each other out so that we're just left with 5v. So we're one step closer to getting this v by itself. And then we have to undo the multiplication. 5v is 5 times v, so the opposite of that, or the way to undo it, is to divide both sides by 5. So 5 divided by 5 is 1v, or just v. 95 divided by 5 is 19. So our answer is v equals 19. And 5 times 19 plus 13 is 108. Let's try another one. Solve for u. u over 3 plus 14 equals 18. Here are my notes. u over 3 plus 14 equals 18. To get this u by itself, the first thing we need to do is subtract 14 from both sides of the equation. Then we have u divided by 3 equals 4. To continue to try to get the u by itself, since we're dividing by 3, the opposite or the way to undo division is to multiply, so we're going to multiply both sides by 3. This one, since it's in a fraction, I think it's easier to see to make this 3 over 1 instead of just 3, so that the 3's cross cancel each other out and we're left with u over 1, which is just u. And then over here, since this is a whole number, I just left the 3 as a whole number and 4 times 3 is 12. To check that, I can plug this 12 in for u. And so instead of u divided by 3, I have 12 divided by 3 plus 14 is 18. 12 divided by 3 is 4. 4 plus 14 is 18. And 18 equals 18. So 12 is the correct answer. Type in the answer that I got in my notes. 12 and click next and it says that I got the correct answer. Thanks for watching.